Candace Kane's Candy Factory is a casual game available for the Nintendo DS, Wii, and PC, where the goal is to match candies in the orders the customers want, and then give the customers the candy before they lose their patience. It's a simple enough premise. The basic idea is that you need to keep up with the conveyor, make sure the candies you actually need are on the conveyor, clear space on the conveyor where necessary to make new candies appear, and, you know, use the candies before they disappear off the end of the conveyor. Given that the game uses the Wii's pointer controls, managing the conveyor is not a problem. You just point at the candies to swap them. It couldn't be much simpler, and obviously they chose the correct control scheme for this. Another layer of challenge I believe is meant to come from the customers themselves, because the customers have different preferences of candy, different patience levels, and they all interact with each other in passive ways. Using the customer's preferences to your advantage can obviously give you much more score, so that way you can reach the required amount of points and succeed at what you're trying to do, which is make it to the next level, assuming you're playing to win, which I assume you are. The game gets harder as it goes on in ways you might expect, with the introduction of more customers that want more complex orders of candy and have different preferences and different patience levels and so on. You also enter new factories with new conveyor layouts where the conveyors may sometimes overlap, making it more difficult to grab the candies you want, but the thing is that this is a very, very easy game. There are actually a lot of secondary mechanics in place to give you additional score if you want to get the gold medal on each level, like a whole lot of secondary mechanics. There are a lot of machines you can buy and upgrade, like a taffy machine, which makes the customer's patience go down less quickly. There is a candy machine that lets you give small treats to your customers to refill their patience. You can match three candies in a row to increase your profits a little bit. You can stack many of the candies, so that way when you give them to the customer they're worth more. There are a lot of ways to gain more score, and I mean a whole lot of ways. But even if, even with me playing the game on an extremely basic and some would argue terrible level, the game is incredibly easy and simple. Like, it's sort of a modern JRPG in terms of difficulty, in the sense that almost everyone could easily complete it, but there are additional mechanics and challenges in place for those that would want them. If all you care about is getting from level to level and finishing the game, then you can make your way through the entire story without really using any of the machines or the combo mechanics or any of the additional score boosters or many nuances the game offers. You can just match the candies and give the orders to the customers while watching out for their patience levels. I am absolutely not any good at Candace Kane's Candy Factory, but I only lost one customer, and that was when I was getting used to a new factory layout and not used to the patience level of a new customer that had appeared. So there isn't much else to say. There's a lot here to unpack if you're willing to go for the extra challenge and multiply your score as much as possible, but it's a casual game completable by just about anyone that can quickly move a Wii pointer across the screen.